Scottish Book Trust exists to inspire readers and writers across Scotland, no matter who they are or where they're from, because we believe that books and reading and writing transform lives and open worlds for everybody. The artworks specifically are really fabulous for taking a library that might not have as much of an impact visually as it could have done, maybe it needs a bit of a refresh. And what we do then is we give it a, a new lease of life effectively. What we wanted to do was to make libraries visible and valued in their community. That brings the community to the library, it makes it a talking point. It's almost impossible to walk past any of the libraries involved in the project without being like, what's that? Can I go in? The workshops were based on a participatory design method developed at Pigeon Perfect which helps to commit input from the local community into the articulation of the five permanent artworks for the libraries. The permanent artworks also provide a physical legacy for Book Week Scotland 2014 and an example of how creative partnerships, collaborative working and an artist-led approach can help to build better communities and better services for everyone in Scotland. I really love the idea of being able to pay homage to your library. I've always loved libraries since I was a kid, so it's just seemed a lovely thing to be able to do, to write a love letter to my library. Being a library user might be a real comfort, a solace, a companion. And for me, it's been really, really exciting to see how very differently each artist has taken the remit of, of Take This Poem and run with it. So I love that in Stockbridge, for example, there's this wonderful children's mobile. I love the range of colours. It's wonderful to come here to Lennox Town Library and to see how Bobby Sayers has interpreted that particular part of the teenage section of the poem. And it's very, very bright and colourful and intriguing. There's enough mystery in it for people to kind of stop and think, what's that about? And, and to have different ideas about what it's about. I love Songcoat's library, um, when you, where you've got the words, you know, browse, borrow, request and renew as a kind of a mantra. And these brilliantly vivid faces right outside that library. I love the way that Shetland Library have invented these multicoloured flags and the flags have the idea of being in a small island and the island's library van in it and that they really appeal to children and these flags will go whirling around and I like that Musselburgh has gone with the idea of public speaking and that you have this, this podium so I find it really really exciting and kind of um, humbling in a way to, to, to see that each artist has taken that one poem and run with it in different directions and that's for me really really gratifying.